weigh like 2,000 pounds, and he's like, what, consistent of like 22 different boulders, and his head is probably grossly larger than... And there's no boulders. real way that a, his any kind of skeletal structure would hold most of those bigger Pokemon up anyway. Yeah. Unless, of course, it's like uber beefy, like, legs. But then again, they're Pokemon. They're built different. Okay, I'm back at the switch. So where do I go? So are Pokemon like pets, or are they like killing machines? I mean, cause couldn't like the army use Pokemon just like go to Iraq and be like, squirt a water gun? Are you forgetting the point that Pokemon don't exist? Well, yeah, but if they did exist, I mean, seriously, they wouldn't just let any random Joe have a Pokemon. It'd be militarized government government stuff, because, I mean, a child can just go around Charmander, Charmander, why don't you do Flamethrower to the whole entire town, I mean. Well, if it, if we're trying to stay consistent to Pokemon, hey Cassie, then. why don't you go rob that candy shop, I mean. If we're trying to stay consistent to Pokemon, arms, so. if we're trying to stay consistent with Pokemon, then everyone's evil intentions would basically die out, because no one ever really does anything evil in Pokemon. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Team Rocket is probably the lamest evil people ever. They have so many opportunities where they could have easily got away and or kill them, but then again, they don't. I mean, seriously, like, there's this, like, one episode where it's like, oh, yeah, we built, I mean, seriously, why don't they reinforce their freaking balloon? Oh, we caught your Pikachu, and he's in a rubber box, so he can't shock us. Oh, sh he has a bird, I forgot. <laughs> the bird just flies it. So it's either Pikachu destroys their corporation, their plan for that day, or, or they the, get or the bird does, or they get half a brain and make it thunder resistant, but then some other Pokemon does. Yeah. You'd think they would. You'd think they would learn to make it resistant to basically every element. Yeah, like a robot's gonna go down by a water gun or bubble beam. Looking at you, Piplup. I took down a gigantic. I'm pretty sure most of the time the th I'm pretty sure most of the time it's actually the grass Pokemon that saves them with a razor leaf or vine whip or something. Yeah, but... And then it's the bird the other times to pop the balloon. I mean, seriously, couldn't, like, they bring a gun one of these days and, like, capture Pikachu while the bird's flying up, just, like, pull out a desert eagle and just blow its face off and... Oh, Everyone's yeah, evil attentions like, are yeah. dead. Guns do not exist in a child's Except thing. Except we have Pokemon that could probably destroy the Earth. I mean, look how destructive Hyper Beam is. That could blow up like a whole entire. That could blow up like a nuclear bomb base. I mean. What? <laughs> I mean, like, you could have Dragonite like fly over a nuclear bomb base, just like blow the crap out of it with Hyper Beam, kill the whole entire world. Then we'd have Fallout 3. And the <laughs> DLC. That's coming to PS3! Suck it, 360 owners! No, I have a 360. I don't hate 360. That's like, I have a back black friend. I'm not a racist. <laughs> I do have black friends. Multiple. You're missing the point. One. No, I don't hate 68, and I'm not a fanboy of PS3. I just think it has better exclusives this year. If you'd like to prove me wrong, send us a comment or leave a video response. I am going to kill you! Oh my god! You know I hate when you do that, so that's why you try to sneak it in every opportunity you get. I <laughs> sneak it in pretty good. Okay, so this is where I was supposed to go because there's stairs here. Yeah, I kind of missed a door. But I am looking forward to Left 4 Dead 2. That's 360 exclusive. Except EA the other day, they posted it was coming out for PS3 on their site, and then the next day took it down. So, EA, what you doing? Don't know. Might like it. Anyways, for all those people that are whining about Left 4 Dead 2, stop whining. Okay? I'm just going to tell you that. Because, hey, it's a, it's a window. It's a great mirror. We already seen the smaller mirror. Don't you recall? No, I wasn't paying attention at all. Anyways, that's what I'm saying. Left 4 Dead 2. Stop whining about it. It's a brand new game. Left 4 Dead 1 may have filled unfinished, but that's why people modded it and made Zoe naked, which is disgusting. Anyways, um... You're really using this as an event for your opinions, huh? Yeah, I am, because my opinions matter like other people's don't. You know, I should make a, I should make a Twitter account about this. Be like... 
Left 4 Dead 2 was awesome. Stupid whiny people that joined the protest group. Die. Just be like that. Just never look at my Twitter ever again. Open like, the giant sun gate to the giant like sun switch. Days, get like 300 million followers. Now this dungeon. Like the population. <laughs> now this dungeon gets easier because they actually show you where you have to go. 300 million people as my followers. It's like the whole entire population of the United States and a little bit extra, I think. I don't know. So you just follow the spots of light and then you get to your next switch. Haha! <laughs> That's simple enough for three-year-olds. Oh my God! Where'd the light go? <laughs> Oh god, the tre the treasure chest is off the light path. What am I supposed to do? I'm oh. getting a lot of things I really don't want or need. Lift for Dead 2. I still haven't finished this topic. Yeah, so... Left for Dead had four campaigns only, but they had a lot of replayability. And if you paid 60 bucks for it, you paid 60 bucks for it. You can't get your money back. They're not going to give you Left 4 Dead 2 for free. They're not going to give it for 30 bucks. It's not a DLC pack. It's brand new people. There's two black people now, and one's a chick. And there's a white guy, and another white guy. So are you stating the obvious on purpose, or what? Yeah, because they keep on seeming to forget this. They act like, oh yeah, it's just a gigantic overpriced DLC pack, which it isn't. The Sun Switch! Go on. Yeah, I'm exactly. Sorry. It's in the day now. That's different. Crazy. Blowing your mind. I wasn't talking about your thing. I was talking about this. The solar tablet. So now you, if you place it in the place... We're not talking about this stupid game that you're playing a Let's Play of. Wouldn't that... This is the most digressive Let's Play ever. Digressive? Yes, it's a new word. It's patented. Pending. I didn't know if you... I don't know if you can get patents on words. I think you can. If I say the word ambidextrous, see, that's never been said before. Actually, it has. But I can say... I don't... I can't even think of a word right now. Think of a random word for me. And I'll give it a meaning and we'll patent it. Right now. Zigalagalagaga! Means death. In African. Wow, that's... Also known as... Also see Chris Redfield. That's... <laughs> I made a fun... Anyway. That's kind of racist, actually. Pending. Nobody used that word. What was that word again? I don't know. Yeah. Nobody used that word. You can use Chris Redfield, but not that word. And the word death, and African, and in. And also, and see. See also. Griffin is defeated. Glover attacks. Whatever. Golem. Glover, Golem, same thing. It's a lucre! <laughs> I made a joke of your joke. Hey, YouTube, it's that time again. No, I don't even... I don't even have any... <laughs> don't choke me. <laughs> well, you ask for it. You can't deny that. That's the whole point. Okay, so if I go up, I should get to the Great Mirror, and then I should put the solar tablet there so I could get through this place? Is that what it's asking me? Say what? What? Nothing. What? Nothing! What? I said say what, and you, like, stared me and, like, gave me the eyes of death. <laughs> I'd like to know. It's nothing. Forget it. Okay. This is the moon. So the next one should be the moon. No, it should be the sun, you dummy. This one's the moon. The next one should be the moon. It's I called a joke, stupid. Idiot. Well, it's a stupid joke. Joke has to have intelligence. Like, oh, hey, I banged your wife yesterday. Yeah. On the table. <laughs> See, that was that was funny and intellectual. It was just brimming with no, if intelligence. I go, if I just go, I banged your wife. I mean, that's that's funny, but it's stupid. They're both. It probably lead to your death. But if you say on the table, he'll go. I made a sandwich there, 
and he'll laugh about it. And then proceed to kill you. That was just brimming with intelligence. Just like this French accent. How is it a French accent if it's only words? Oh, people say that commission a schnapp is a farmer. It sounds more like German. Shrug. It's just long and g past. But we should not underestimate the schnapp man. Reminds me of Bruno. Ich bin Bruno. Have you seen trailers for that movie? No? YouTube? Anybody? 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 Hey, YouTube! <laughs> I'm going to do that every time you start saying, hey, YouTube, okay? Pick your poison. Pick your favorite poison. Is it arsenic? <laughs> 